Yo guys, welcome back to uh, episode 2 of Darius the Sports Talk. My name is Darius. I am going to be uh, hosting this today. Uh, last video, if you guys haven't seen it, down below in the description, it's going to be uh, listed so you guys can watch it. But I was just basically talking about uh, one half of teams who are going to be taking players in the draft or they're going to trade up, who's going to make the biggest impact in the first half of the draft. Um, so this video today is going to be talking about the teams that made the playoffs and what they're going to do, what the positions and needs that they need for their team. So to start it off, Philadelphia Eagles, I do have them taking a defensive end with the 21st pick. Um, they do need pass rushing on the defensive line, and especially when you're in a, a division with Dak Prescott on the Cowboys, you have Daniel Jones on the Giants, and you have uh, Dwayne Haskins as the quarterback in Washington. So they're going to need a guy who can just get around the offensive lineman and do his thing. So pass rusher is what they're going to do. Um, 22nd pick I have, Minnesota Vikings are going to take a receiver at this uh, selection. They just traded Stephon Diggs, so they need another guy to compliment Adam Thielen, who is their number one receiver on the opposite end. So receiver is the way to go. Um, I do have a trade with the 23rd pick between the Patriots and the Ravens. So the Ravens are going to take the 23rd pick from the Patriots, and the Patriots are going to slide down to the 28th pick. With this pick, the Ravens are going to take a linebacker. Inside linebacker or an outside linebacker, just they need a linebacker all, all around. I would say they need an outside linebacker. Just feel like it would fit them more. They have C.J. Mosley on the inside already, so he would be the perfect fit. Well, I mean, inside, obviously. On the outside, they need a pass rush on the outside, so like a, a Von Miller type or a Khalil Mack, so that's what they're going to do. Um, 24th pick, uh, Saints. Who's going to stop them Saints? Um, possibly Tampa Bay, but we'll see how the season goes with that. Um, 24th pick, they're going to take a wide receiver to complement Michael Thomas and Emmanuel Sanders. So they would need somebody in the slot who can run on the inside, who's super fast and speedy, you know, who go all the way down the field. So they will definitely look to upgrade that position there. 25th pick uh, is also the Vikings. They're going to take a corner. They drafted Mike Hughes a couple years ago. He hasn't really lived up to the expectation as injuries have kind of held him up. Also, they just got rid of Xavier Rhodes. So they're looking for a guy to come in, step in and fill that role, possibly be a number one, if not a number two. Um, the 27th pick, I'm going to skip Miami, who had the 26th pick. They're going to take a center, though. They drafted a quarterback earlier in the draft, so get an offensive lineman. 27th pick, Seattle Seahawks. They're taking a linebacker. They need. They just got rid of Jadavion Clowney. I don't know if they're going to bring him back or not. If they don't, got to fill that defense some more. Bobby Wagner can't do it all. Um, and then the 28th pick, this is where I had that trade with the Patriots coming in. So the Patriots have this pick. They are going to take a quarterback, I believe. Tom's gone. They need a franchise guy to step in. Um, if they don't draft a QB, if they say, let's say they bring in Cam Newton or some other quarterback, Jameis Winston, they're going to go a running back. They need a one-two punch. They already have Sonny Michelle they drafted a couple years ago. They need another guy to compliment him, back him up. Going to skip Tennessee and Green Bay. Going to go to the world champion Kansas City Chiefs. They're going to take a corner. The reason they need a cornerback is because the guys they have now, they're either old or they are not living up to the hype they're not really doing the best that they can right now so and especially when you got my broncos taking uh jerry judy hopefully hopefully we'll see later tonight um and Cortland sudden and just so many great receivers in the afc west so they're looking to bump up their secondary and that would be a great pickup for them um if you guys have any comments below about teams that you feel who they should uh trade or you know who they should draft leave them in the description below guys name's darius this is uh, episode two of uh, the NFL Draft Sports Talk. And, yeah, we'll be right back at it with episode three coming soon.